journal and uh, I think I want to do this one today so we need the deck of cards here they are <clears throat> deck of cards oh our papers are lining it and let's take let's take two this time uh, chevron and squiggles hmm, chevron and squiggles okay we got this Okay, so I'm gonna let this completely dry because I think I want to put this across the gap between the two. I might put them like put it like this 
but I'm really feeling that it should be the barrier between the two. Um, and since I did this with my, my droppers, um, there's a lot of ink on there, kind of like there was on this one. Um, chevrons, squiggles, really the only difference between my chevrons and my squiggles are my chevrons um, are pointy and my squiggles are curvy. Um, here's their chevrons and squiggles. Um, and they didn't connect theirs. They just made theirs just basically like V's for their chevrons. Um, but I don't know. I've always thought of a chevron pattern as connecting. So I connected mine. Uh, let's see if I can show you without, you know, it might be pretty much dry. Um, so anyway, I connect my chevrons. Uh, they didn't. And then squiggles, I just made squiggles, but I wanted to tie all the colors in. So I did put the blue, um, here. I mean the, uh, the dots in. So that it would be blue and green and pink and green. Um, and I do actually want to go through and outline my squiggles with black, I think. And other than that little guy right there, I think everybody else is dry. So let's do this. Let's. Oh, sacrilege. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, I guess everybody was dry. Nothing picked up. Okay. Um, even this little guy? Yeah, I guess so. Alright, so let's get my black pen and I'm going to outline my squiggles and then I'll add on my label and we'll call it done. I think I can trim this just a hair and get it to fit. I shouldn't have put the spaces in there. <laughs> it's not perfectly straight because now there is my space. But, it fits. Alright, chevron and squiggles. Bye, y'all.